to-go boxes. Our to-go boxes, they're not good. They're f***ing amazing. How did we get started here at Albemarle Paper? Well, late 2008, my cousin John and I started this paper company, and we got all sorts of different products. Hey, Nick, come on, man. Let's get to work. We got cleaning products, too? You got a party this weekend? We got your back. Anything you need here at APS. Plates, napkins, silverware, table covers. We got everything covered. Right, boys? Mm. What are the items do we carry? Paper towels? I got it. Toilet paper? I got it. Gloves? We got you. Pizza boxes? You're probably wondering, where are we? Where's Albemarle Paper? Don't you worry about that. We got you. I'll bring the product to the door. I mean, it's kind of the life of the goalkeeper. I try to try to turn the page pretty early on last week. Um, I think anyone who knows me knows I'm I'm a competitor, just like uh, anyone else, maybe even more. So you know, just felt absolutely awful on Saturday night. Um, you know, didn't do my job. But for me, the biggest thing was uh, you know, just like anything hard in life, it's about how you react. So that was my big thing: is just playing my role as impeccably as I could tonight, and um, ultimately just getting getting a result. That's what it was always about. And the truth is. Uh Defense is not a single person's effort. It's a team thing. Like tonight, your, your blocking shots, but the team is clearing it out. And, you know, keep coming out, and, you, know, you know, survive in the second half. Yeah, I mean, I can't say enough about those boys in front of me tonight. And uh, it's it's been a trend all season long. We've been a little bit unlucky, um, and we know we've got to cut out the individual errors. Um, but you see what it comes together like when we when we do it. Um, so you know, tonight played a pretty clean game, especially us in the back line. Uh, and we're really able to limit their chances, and they were pretty frustrated on the stretch. So, like I said, um, especially Bill and Adil, those guys right in front of me, um, you know, we've weathered the storm a little bit, and we're hoping to come out on the other side of this and be a, a better defensive team. You had 18 goals for number one and being your team to win the league. Are you prepared for this long stretch? Yeah, yeah. I mean, um, I mean, you said I was pretty busy, but for the most part it was just, you know, cleaning up, commanding my area. Um, but I, I thought as a team, you know, back to front, we defended really well tonight. Because, um, like you said, they are quite talented, and we limited their chances a lot. So they didn't really have much on goal. Oh, uh, it's it's uh, great. I was just talking, including Open Cup. This is my ninth pro game, and is my first clean sheet. So finally, great to get one of those under under the belt. Um, probably would have liked it a little bit earlier, but it's it's just as sweet now. So hopefully, something we can build off. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, I mean, start off with my center defenders, guys who are in conversations with me and the, the rest of the goalkeepers day in, day out, um, trying to play more cohesively. And, you know, Adil's a young guy, fantastic on the ball. Um, like me, like some of the other guys, we've had individual mistakes, and uh, maybe he hasn't gotten to shine as much as I believe he should. He's such a such a top player. Um, but, you, you know, you can see how, how quality he is on the ball, how calm he is, and then um, you know, his finished product, blocking shots and whatnot is fantastic. Uh, and then Bill, you know, coming in, meshing with a new team, such an experienced guy, um, a guy that I get along with really well personally. Um, and you see him on the field tonight, so good in the air, almost got a goal um, right at the start off a set piece, always clearing and blocking. So just a, a really brave guy, and I always commend that. And then, uh, you know, the outside backs, I think, especially in coaches, you know, style of play, they've, they've got a hybrid of roles, whether it's on the ball or defensively. Um, so you know how they've been able to, to, to figure that out and Harry being in the lineup for the you know the last few games doing really well he's one of the best players in the field no matter what position you put him in and then Nathan you know coming in and out of the squad to come back in tonight and do such a good job and it just shows how much of a pro he is and why he's been able to do it at the top level for so long. Uh, it was really important for me I mean especially you know with how the game went personally um, the, the end of the last match, the biggest thing for me is I, I, it, it gives me so much joy um, as a, a kid from the Carolinas to see how rowdy these fans get and how much it means to them. And the last thing I want is them leaving, going home, you know, not entertained or, or not pleased with the final you know, product that we put out on the field. So for me, it was intense, intense focus all week to make sure that you know, not only me, but the guys, the team put out a performance that we could be proud of. And ultimately, that results in you know, a result that comes out. I mean, I think probably at the end of the day, you look at just 
committing to the game plan we had, which was you know more of a counter game plan, um, sitting in a little bit more and weathering you know the storm, and then breaking out and, and getting chances, which they they didn't really take too much depth tonight. We had a lot of joy over the top, um, but you know like Steve said, I uh, he said it was a busy night for me. It, it didn't really feel like too much of a busy night. I felt like you know we were always in control, and they really really struggled to to manufacture any sort of real real chance. So it's it's all credit to the guys in front. Stave off complacency, probably. It's probably everyone's initial feeling is, uh, you know, you want to rest, you want to celebrate a little bit, but, um, and I think that's really good to do tonight because it is, you know, a shutout first win at home in the season. Um, but as much as possible, when we wake up tomorrow morning, it's got to be a new week, and we've got to turn the page for Tormenta, and then really quickly turn the page again for DC. So one game at a time. What does Jordan have to do to start? I'm, I'm a simple guy. Um, unfortunately, my family couldn't make it to the game tonight, so uh, it's just me, but probably just rest. I mean, it's, uh, like I said, it's a quick turnaround. I want to be good at training tomorrow, so head off, get to bed. Yeah, it's fantastic. I mean, Kalina is an utmost professional. You've seen you know, the quality that he can put out on the field. Um, how he is as a, in, as a leader in our locker room and all around, you know, just human being. So he supported me uh, from day one of playing uh, this season, and he did the same for Pablo. Um, but I, I'd say the competition is is really high amongst all three of us. I mean, Pablo, me, and Kalina, we're, I think we're a really high-performing group in training, and then you see when it comes out of the field, it's not too much of a drop-off. So, uh, you know, it's, it's really good. Everyone always says iron sharpens iron, and I, I truly believe that. I think that whoever is the guy who is out on the field, which, you know, at the end of the day, I'm working, so that could be me. Um, but whoever it is, they're, they're going to be having a great final product because they've got two guys behind them who are really pushing them. Absolutely. Um, you know, as well as we weather the storm down the stretch, probably need to find ways to finish it off, make sure that they play around us rather than through us. Um, because all it takes is a moment when you have quality players like they do, um, and, they, and they showed it. Luckily, luck was a little bit on our side. We, we played with a, a nice, strong high line, and, um, you know, fortune favored us a little bit. But as a personally, as a goalkeeper, I'll, I'll look at the clips for sure, and that'll be a main one, a talking point. Maybe could do something differently to to make sure that the next time when it's not offsides, I can save it. Yeah, but uh, I was also surprised, you know, after this shot. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was amazing, amazing goal. And, and I, I'm so happy because always when I have the ball in my right foot, I try to control, I try to go to my, my left left foot. But, but yes, I finish with the right. And, and yes, I'm, I'm happy because it's important goal and uh, important three points for us. Yeah, 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 of course, yes. On the second trip to Denver, the ball went through from the Dick Center and then through the Denver. Uh, no, I try, uh, I looked to, uh, I was looking if someone is, is running and I uh, saw Mackenzie, so I want to take one more touch and, and I was thinking I have time to control the ball and pass to, to Mackenzie and and then he have, uh, he can have uh, the empty goal, but, but yeah, uh, I play, uh, Really slow in this action, but but yeah, but finally we won. So this this is the most important today. Yeah. You and you and Camille have been connecting more often in recent games. Is this partially due to you know, your time together with the national team? Or more I I, I don't think so. I think uh, of course we know each other from from I don't know under under 17, 18 in in, in Polish national team. But but I think. Uh, all our players in front, we, we have much better connection in, in this game, you know. And then this, how I play with, with Enzo today, or with, with uh, Kerwin or, or Camille, was, was, was I think was really good. And then this is what we need in the, in the next games, to, to stay compact in defense, to be together. And then to, when we have the ball, to, to go to, to counter-attack or, or to keep the ball together in front and, and try to do something. So I think today was 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 really really good up front uh, in in front. Speaking of that, how has that chemistry developed with like specifically you and Enzo? You know, I know uh, Coach Conzi in the press conference mentioned that he's been 
Yeah, for what I can say, I don't know, maybe we need that time because Enzo it was coming like two months ago, so maybe we, we need more time to, to connect better, but, but I think game by game and then training by training it's 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 it's, it's better and then I think today was our our best game in, in this season and and I hope uh, in next week against DC because also it's important game for us and, and if we can Win two games in the row will be something something good for us, and then we can go higher and higher in the table. And then this for for us is is the most important now. Yeah. Yeah, we know we we start this season not so good, and then but still we have all stadium. You know, I know they don't open the 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 up of the stadium, but but 30,000 in every game is it's something special in this league because I think it's the, the best uh, fans in this league. And then I'm so happy and I think uh, my teammates as well to, to, to win uh, at home first game in the season. And, and I hope now we can build this, uh, I don't know how to say in English, but uh, like, you know, like win every game, yeah, like win every game or, or, or don't lose because we need the points and then this win, yeah, it's it's something special for us, for our fans, and then yeah, we are so happy. Yeah. I think for sure, yeah, I'm DP, so I, I know the pressure is uh, on me, on Enzo, on, on Camille, and we need to to have the the goals, the assists, and and. Uh, maybe my my beginning of the season was not so good, but I think game by game, last three games I think play I play much much better, and then today I score. Last game I have two assists, so so yeah, I'm I'm happy with my performance in, in the last couple of weeks, and I hope uh, yeah I will keep this in uh, next uh, the next game, and then the, I hope all season I can play like 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 tonight or like last week. Yeah, I think in defense was our the best game in in this season because uh, we stay compact and and okay before we we go like crazy you know we want to press every ball but but we don't need to do this just we need to stay compact and and sometimes give the ball to 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 our opponents and and when we have the ball today we go like three four times in a really good counter attack you know and we can score more goals and and we can close this game early then then wait until last minute but but yeah i think uh, our team today was was uh, really really good in in defense and and how we stay compact this we we need to have in every game yeah, of course, both been joking about uh, pressing for uh, Neil, but it's all good news up here uh, not yet, uh, but I say him happy birthday uh, before the game. But I, I say to him, I want to wait when, when you score the goal, and I will come to you and I will say this when you score. But uh, I say him before the game, and then uh, yeah, I, I'm happy because uh, last season was was really difficult for him, and then this season he 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 started really really good, and today again amazing game, uh, and then he was man of the match, and then, uh, yeah, I'm so happy. Yeah. Coach Latanga has talked a lot about wanting that half possession, uh, controlling that. Was that something tactically that you kind of spoke about not having tonight to let to you know, sit back a little more and let them have the ball? I think uh, in every game we we want to control the game, but sometimes you know when you have difficult time, like you cannot win the game and you are one zero up, up uh, in front, so. You try to do everything to, to, to keep this result until the end because you need the points. And uh, also, uh, Columbus is, is really a really good good team in this season and uh, they score a, a lot of goals. And, and uh, I'm so happy because we keep uh, clean sheets today and, and this is also 
uh, important for our defense, for, for our goalkeeper, uh, and maybe we, we can have more confidence in, in, in next games.